Hey y'all, it's the Costume Jeweler. We're back in Florida. We are going to head into this Goodwill to take a look around for knickknacks, doodads, whatnots, and purses. They don't have any jewelry in here. We're also going to go down the street to the Salvation Army afterwards. Hopefully they are open. And we're going to try to knock out two stores in one video so that you guys have something to watch. So subscribe to the channel. Hit that thumbs up for this video. Hit that notification bell and click all so you don't miss out on my live buy nows and auctions of purses and jewelry. And let's go in here and see if we can find anything to pick up to resell on YouTube and eBay. So you never know what you're going to find in any of these stores. I come into this one not super often. There's actually a TJ Maxx and a Ross right across from it that I love to go into. Look at this bicycle. I love that bicycle. That would be so much fun, wouldn't it? Curious as to how much it is, but I don't see... I don't know how much that is. That would actually make a good Halloween prop. I like those a little bit too. Y'all have seen this one before. I've had it. I could jewel that one out. I really think I'm going to get that white one and I can put a lot of jewels on it. I'll show you just a second. Look at this one. This is kind of cool. What I was thinking is on this one right here, it's all plain and white. It's five dollars. I could put like a lot of jewelry on it, maybe. I'm not sure. Ooh. Bloody bat mask. I like that. Costume mask. My favorite month is coming up. It's here already. How much is this one? So this Goodwill has quite a few things. This is where I got my top hat one year. So I bought a top hat one year here. It was really great. I don't know if they have another one any this year or not. And I said they don't have jewelry, but they do have some jewelry in here. I'm not sure what that little bird is. Nutcracker Holiday Musical Egg. I don't ever see I see a coach bag there. I wonder where the coach is. Definitely lots of Halloween. So if you're looking for Halloween things, if I were you, I would come to the Goodwill first. kinds of costumes too and the props I don't see any top hats this year I wish I would have bought them when they had them last time Take a look at these purses. See what they've got here. If anything old or new. What is this one? 
Never heard of that brand before. I think I spotted. Let's see if this is. Haven't been to the big purse superstore lately. The big purse superstore is one in Clearwater that I love to go to. London Fog. Never know if you're going to find any wallets or not. Looks like a beach bag. I wish this fossil wasn't $40. Look at this, guys. So this is a fossil. We're going to pass on it. $40. Not sure how much it would go for. Super cute though with that crossbody pebbled leather. Lots of Vera Bradley. This is brand new. $71 retail value. Wonder what they have on this. This is a huge purse. I don't sell a lot of Vera Bradley. I have some and have posted some in the past. What is this one? I don't sell a lot of it. What brand is this? Kenneth Cole patent leather. That's a lot of Vera Bradley. I think somebody gave up their whole closet. I think somebody, I love this fossil though. I just wish it weren't. Looks vintage. Very nice. So they did have a few rings in here. Not many, but a few. There's a Dooney hidden. I'm going to take a look at the whatnots, doodads, and trinkets. Let's see if there's anything over here. got to dig through all of this because it is packed. Concrete bird feeder. That's cute. 
ten dollars. Wish I'd found these for the farmhouse. I'm not gonna mail them back to myself, but I like those. Super colorful. Made in Brazil. Aren't those cute? Hand painted too, probably. I should start selling smalls. I don't though, but I love looking at them. old Dolly Parton candle. Primitives by Kathy. Look at this cute wood bench. Eight dollars. Eight dollars. That's I like that. Look at this old vintage jewelry box. So what were these used for? This is ten dollars. Look at this. This guys, this does not have any chips in it whatsoever. Looks like it might be made in Italy or something. It's not new. It is old. So thirty-four dollars. Never heard of that brand. Don't know it. If y'all know that brand made in Italy before, comment below and let me know because I've never ever seen that. Here's a cute bushel basket, a smaller version of one. I don't know if somebody actually hand painted this themselves. That would have been cute out the farmhouse. If 
These caught my eye, but I sure don't need anything else. These are probably copper. They're five dollars each. But I do believe these are copper. Probably mid-century modern. Let the beauty of what you love be what you do. I like that. A great quote. All right, on to the next store, which is Salvation Army. Did not find anything in that Goodwill. Saw a fossil uh, crossbody bag that's really nice. Let's go to the Salvation Army next and see what we can pick up for resale on YouTube and eBay. So we left the Goodwill. Now we're going into the Salvation Army down the street. Check this place out. They do have jewelry and purses, knickknacks, doodads, and whatnots. All of those good, great things. We're going to go in here and see if we can find anything. Last time I came here, I found a coach uh, backpack. I haven't sold it yet. And this is the table where I found that coach backpack so we're gonna look and see what they've got I don't know why they put their purses here like they do they'll have some hanging up and then they'll also have them over here and you've just got to dig around which is okay I've found lots of great things digging around I have. Just never know. It's like digging through those bins that we've went through before. You just have to dig around. Artsy Zen. So this is a this is handmade. Artsy Zen on Etsy. Yeah, hit that thumbs up for this video, click that notification bell, click all so you don't miss out on live buy it nows. Come to a live sale sometime, I think you'll really like it, it's a lot of fun. Never dug through those wallets over there, they were in that big container. We may have to do that just a little bit, see what there is. That. Coldwater Creek. a little bit see if there's anything in here can't live without I've been working on my Halloween hats so I'm actually gonna do an auction of one of them so I'm creating one that's from 1920s and I'm actually going to do an auction on it in one of the sales They've got some jewelry in here. This is 19. Maybe we'll find something in this store today. Sure. Over here's where they have the other purses. Ooh, 
Looks like it's leather, not branded. It's very quiet in here. Oh, is this real snake skin? Nicole Miller. I like getting real snake skin. What is this? Evan Bacconi. never know doesn't take me long to work through these things this kind of reminds me of a carpet bag purse it's definitely not old but that's what it reminds me of let's see need to go to the Clearwater store at some point not today is this coach it's looking a little bit like that might be a coach. And it's not. It's Tijanello. Tignanello. Tignanello. What is this one? Tignanello. There's a jean purse. That one's Glow by J-Lo. Michael Kors, Rosetti, oh my gosh, and look at this, I wonder if this is real snake skin, so this looks like 1950s for sure, it's not the cutest bag ever, but do you believe it's snake skin? That's all the purses. We didn't find any purses. Let's go look at the whatnots, doodads, and knickknacks. And the pictures. I sure don't have any room for those either. But that does not stop us from looking. Well, that's kind of cool. Look at that. Mirror cling for Halloween. Look at these old metal home decor. Look at that. Love it. By Royal, $9.99. Those would go great around some old photos. Seems to be a recurring theme. Now what is this, an old napkin holder? See what this is made doesn't say who it's made by. Eight dollars. Now that's beautiful. these glasses right here so I wish I'd have found these in Texas I would have used them at the Airbnb there's only three of them three I wonder if there's a fourth somewhere I don't see it and this Rosetti must be special because it's behind the counter see if there's anything here i love the dragon fly bracelets wow there's some oh wow there's some good bracelets in here 
we're gonna have to take a look at these oh my gosh we do 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 I love this gold piece right here too wow we've got to take a look at those that's pretty look at that and this bracelet is too but look at it though it's missing a couple of what's well, missing one stone right there I'm not sure if that could be replaced or not this is not designer mark but I like that this one appears to be old love it here's the back of it not designer marked but we're gonna get that one I love that one this is Laura Janelle I think I've seen these before this brand or had it I wish this were not missing a black stone maybe that could be replaced Attention though customers, we are closing in 15 minutes. this one's in great shape it looks old too Let's look at this Three dragonflies. One is missing a wing. Love this one too. I don't think this is sterling, but I think it's real cute. And we're gonna get that too. Stretch bracelet, Christmassy. This one looks old too because look at the clasp. Clasp looks like it's made of copper. I wonder how old that necklace is. I don't know what that's made of either. Cannot tell. But it's cute. And this is cute right here too. What is there here? Rosary. What is this? Great surfers, but you can't dodge this looks really old look at this gorgeous piece right here we're gonna put that on that hat that I'm gonna give away or not give away but put for auction we're gonna get that love that one We found all this stuff, guys, in under 30 minutes. So, guys, that was two stores in under 30 minutes. That was the first Goodwill in Salvation Army. We found a lot of great things in that Salvation Army. We did pick up some jewelry for resale on YouTube and eBay. So, hit that notification bell, click all, subscribe to the channel, give a thumbs up to this video. And until next video or next live sale, y'all have a great week and welcome to October.